So after giving this a rewatch, does it get better? Let's find out. Yeah, today I'm going to review the 2010 movie Despicable Me. Yeah, this isn't a rant, actually. So the plot of this movie is where this supervillain named Gru, played by Steve Carell, is wants to be the most powerful, famous villain ever, and he's competing with another villain named Vector, played by Jason Segel, and... Vector stole a pyramid, but Gru wants to do more than that. He wants to steal the moon, so he d he thinks, how could he do that? Well, he wants to steal Vector's shrink ray to shrink the moon so he can take it, and he decides to adopt three girls, and he tries to enslave them, I guess, and then Gru grows a connection and tries to become a father to the girls, and tries to be a good villain and a good dad at the same time. Yeah, this movie, it's pretty by the numbers. But, it's fun. Honestly, re-watching this, I had a fun time. Ain't gonna lie, I used to love this movie. Around the time this came out on Blu-ray, I used to watch it all the time. I used to love this movie. And looking back, I can see why. The animation is good. It's not Pixar or DreamWorks quality, but it's still solid. The voice acting, a lot of the voice actors do really try. I love Steve Carell as Gru. His um, performance as Gru, like his accent is like, it's really funny. It cracks me up. I remember as a kid, I always used to entertain my mom by... By doing an impression of Gru, I still got it in me. Yeah, it's it may be a generic and may not be a masterpiece, but it's not meant to be. It's just meant to be a fun little movie, and you know what? There's nothing wrong with that, so... Yeah, honestly, looking back, I enjoy Despicable Me. It's not one of my favorite animated movies ever, but I still really enjoy it. Uh looking back on it, I guess it's the nostalgia of it, even though this movie doesn't even feel that old, but yeah, I would, this would normally be the time if I recommend it or not, but I think just about now everyone has seen this movie since it's really popular, so yeah, looking back, Despicable Me ain't so bad after all, so yeah, that's my review of Despicable Me, see you next time.